gotta tell y'all something. I, I'm not even joking around. I don't even know what to do. I, I'm so mad. I don't know. I gotta, I gotta go. I, I, gotta, I gotta see y'all in a second. All right, y'all, another day, another dollar. Your girl is back, and I love it, saying, let me holla. I'm back. It's like a few days later, you can tell. New hair, new lashes. I mean, they ain't individuals, they strips, but they look better than the ones I had on, so we gonna just go with it. Um, but yeah, it's been a couple days. I'm actually about to go pick up some brunch. You know your girl always gotta try something new, pretty much every vlog, every vlog, every vlog, every vlog, every vlog. So, I'm at this place, and let me tell you something, y'all. This place better be good, because I'm, I'm embarrassed to even tell y'all how much I just spent on this breakfast. <sighs> Once again, y'all know I love um, chicken and waffles, but I wanted French toast this time, but it didn't. I mean, they had, I don't know, it's like a real fancy place. Uh, it's over, not over here, it's over there. That blue, like those tents over there, I'm going over there. It's called, I don't know why somebody just left me a voicemail, because I don't even know how to check my voicemail. So, FYI, don't ever leave me a voicemail. Um, but I'm going into this place called Unconventional Diner. And baby, I just paid almost $40 for some chicken, waffles, eggs, and potatoes. And I'm embarrassed. Don't even judge me. Don't even judge me. I don't think they need masks out here because I'm in DC and I don't think, I don't see nobody wearing a mask, but then that's more of a reason for me to put on a mask. So let me put on, oh, let, me shut this up. let me put on my mask and run in. I'm not going to eat in there. I mean, I could, but they have outside season too. It's actually not that cold outside. I could sit outside. But where I have my car park, if you know anything about DC, you will get cold. So I don't know. Let me see. Because I do want to give y'all a different scenery than my car. So I'm going to take y'all in there. I'm not sure if my food is ready yet. I've been sitting in the car waiting for about um like 15 minutes. So it should be ready. So yeah. Let me show y'all what it looked like. So it's. Y'all really can't see. I'm gonna show y'all what the fuck inside. But I'm walking towards this place. But so they have like a scene right here. But I mean, I just have to sit here. But it's a lot of background noise. Like I got my AirPod in. So hopefully it's connected. Oh, okay. So it's fancy. It's fancy. Let me show y'all. Oh, this is Fuji's over turn turns, clearly. But you know, they got the grass in the wall. It's cute. It's cute. They got super club chicken dinner for $45. That's what I'm here. Good. I'm picking up for Kaylina. I don't know if it's done or not. Kaylina. K-A-L. Oh, Kaylina. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. You too. So, I feel like they already knew I was recording. Because she's just like staring at me. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll eat outside. It's something different. Um, nobody's out here. So, I guess I can try my food outside. It's not that cold. I turned my hazard lights on, so. I don't know, can we not sit here? Is that why nobody's here? Like, I don't want to sit down and start eating, and this might be like, um, ma'am, you can't sit here. Um, I don't know. I just feel more comfortable in my car. Honestly, I do. Like, I'm sorry, y'all. I gotta, I'm sorry. I want to be different, but like, I just feel more comfortable in my car. And it's also, it's not hot outside. It's, it's not cold, but it's not hot either. So, oh, thank you. Yeah, so. I'm gonna try this in the car with y'all so you can see what this tastes like because it better be golden. My wig is like definitely screwed up. You see it's windy outside? That's why I didn't really want to eat outside anyways. Um, but yeah, let me put y'all up here. All right, so y'all know I'm always going to try the food on camera for y'all. I'm still waiting for American Idol. I don't know why they're not calling me, but I'm getting a little depressed. As y'all can tell, I'm in a better mood than I was on Sunday. Oh, let me turn my hazard lights off. So let me try this on camera for y'all real quick. If y'all want to try this and you come to DC, this is called Unconventional Diner. I don't know which street this is on. I don't know where I'm at. I don't know. But what's this? Let's see what this is. Okay, these are the eggs. These definitely look like they're gonna put me on the toilet, but these look better than the other ones. And they gave me a, a lot, well, I don't wanna say a lot more, but let me show y'all. So y'all can see. These, I mean, these look better than those other dry ones that they gave me. They put some cheese on these ones. They, these got a little bit of red seasoning on them. I don't know what that is, but we'll try it. 
You know, remember this cost thirty five dollars plus tax. Um, this is a light box. What's this? Uh, they gave me this little ranky dang old McDonald's hash browns. They gave me two. That's fine, but I thought I was getting home fries. Okay. All right. Well, whatever. It's chicken. Let me just try the chicken at least. Maybe they purposely gave me no syrup because this this waffle has stuff in there. Like this is the I think this is gravy. Waffle is kind of dry, but it had what is that? Um, I don't know. I gotta take this coat off because it's getting hot. It's a guy that looks real rough behind me. He looks like he's walking up to my car. Lock the door. Uh, anyways, and I asked for utensils, and I don't have no utensils. Like, come on, Kaylina, you have to start checking your bag before you leave. Let me taste one of these hash browns. Dang, can I eat anything? These hash browns seem ranky dang. Oh, I said my grace. Amen. These hash browns soggy. It's soggy. And so I'm not gonna make that home. I'm gonna try to use this chicken. Now that other chicken was good, remember y'all? This chicken seemed a little dry. Maybe that's why they gave me gravy. Y'all, this chicken ain't got no season on it. It was zero season. I could've went back to the other place and just paid $25 again. I'm just trying to try new stuff, but it's not hidden and I'm mad. Mm -mm. Then why you stick to chicken and strips and fries? Cause you pay forty five dollars for stuff like this and it's nasty. Let me try. Well, I don't even know what this is. I think this is gravy, but it's not hidden at all. It is a whole bunch of yolk, whole bunch of jibber jabber in the in this container. It don't taste like nothing. Just a whole bunch of colors in there, and don't got no flavor in it. What is this? I think this is hot sauce. Hey, maybe this is a hill. <clears throat> it's hot. Mm -hmm. It looks just like mumble sauce. If you're from the DMV, you know what mumble sauce is. I don't know if they got mumble sauce nowhere else. I love mumble sauce. This is a little better on it. That gravy stuff ain't it. I'm so annoyed. I don't want to get back out of the car to ask for a syrup. But I need also a fork to eat my potatoes. I mean, not my potatoes, my eggs. This is butter. Let me just try this waffle real quick because I might not even like it. I'm moving on there. Girl. 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 Come on now, girl. Come on now. What? Girl. This the driest. I know you lying. I know you lying. I know you lying. Now I know you lying. I know you lying now. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No. Oh, well, I didn't even need to get out of the car to get no syrup. This ain't even a waffle. This is cornbread, dry cornbread. And I'm saying, your girl know cornbread because your girl, you, you, you got a country girl here. I know cornbread. This is this is terrible. This is terrible. This ain't nothing but cornbread shaped like a waffle. And I don't know what that green and red stuff is, but no. If I'm gonna rate this, well, I ain't taste the eggs yet. I guess I'm gonna have to eat the eggs with a, you know, go back to the hood style. I'm gonna eat it with a fork. I mean, a top. Let me just try it because there ain't even no sense to me if I don't like it. Hmm. I'm so high. I gotta turn the air back on. Okay, you know, hood life. What did I say earlier? Eggs look like they call a lot seat. That's why I don't need to eat in my car. Eggs look like they got a lot of season on them. Ain't got not now a little bit of season on this little eggs right here. This tastes like paper. I should go ask for a refund. Forty-five dollars. I mean, what I say? Thirty-five dollars, y'all, for this. Hash browns could have came from McDonald's from one dollar. I don't even eat McDonald's, but I'd rather had that than this. Cause I think them hash browns five dollars. Now I'd have messed them. Got two. They probably charged me ten dollars for two four hash browns. Chicken tastes like nothing but oxygen. This waffle tastes like just the driest cornbread you could ever taste. The only thing that's good is the mumbo sauce. And then they can't take responsibility for that. Because I think a black man made that. I'm just so... I'm just getting screwed up all the way around. I 
eyelashes, food, uh, no utensils. Please, I'm scared to even go on by my day. Lord, well, I guess I'll get on back to y'all then. <laughs> hey, I tried, I tried, I really tried. Y'all saw I tried, y'all know I done tried. I, I'm gonna get back to y'all. I'm gonna go to the store or something. I gotta buy myself something to boost my mood. All right, y'all, so I just decided to do something random. It's not really random, because I've been wanting to get this done for a while. I don't know what's going on with my eyelashes. But I was just like, hey, let's just do it. Let's just do it today. I just pulled up to get my nose pierced. I've been wanting to stuff forever, and I just never got it. I wasn't really sure what side I wanted to get it on. I think I want to get both done, but I think I'm not just going to get the left side done right now. Because my right side, I don't know if you can tell, but my right side always just already looks swollen. My left side is not that bad, or it just might be my nose is just big. But I kind of cheated a little bit because I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. I used the numbing stuff that I used one time for, like, my wax. Um, It's called the Numb 20. I've seen this on TikTok and it's supposed to numb the area. It's been like 15 minutes. I don't know if that's enough minutes or not, but hopefully it make it hurt less. I don't know if they're gonna let me record in here. I'm gonna try and see if I can set my camera up. Hopefully they're nice. So I'm so excited. I've been wanting this forever. So let's just go on in and see what's going on. I just wanted to see if I can get my nose pierced. Pardon? I just wanted to see if I can get my nose pierced. Okay. Yeah. So just make sure I'll help you out too with your camera. If you are not a fan of blood, don't, don't watch this but skip forward. Um, but if you see like it's starting to bleed again, it's bleeding from the bottom too. Um, so I just gotta keep this on there. I think it's just me, but to be fair, my tattoos didn't bleed that much. I don't know. I didn't know your nose would bleed more than this. Cause I actually, I don't know if you remember, like if I, you were real OG, I used to have my cartilage pierced on this side. I let it close up because it was just annoying. That didn't bleed, but that is probably because the cartilage doesn't have. I thought the nose was gonna be the same as the cartilage. Honestly, pain-wise, it was just a quick like got. That's what it was. It wasn't all that. It wasn't that painful. Um, but I'm gonna have to get some more of these because it's bleeding like crazy. But she told me to take care of it. I don't have. Oh shit. Okay, I gotta get back to y'all. Oh no, I gotta get back to y'all. Ah! All right, y'all. I got some, I got myself together a little bit, a little bit. I had to put um a wipe. And I'm trying not to press too hard because I think that's why it keeps like squirt bleeding like that. Um, but to be honest, I love it. I love it. I love it. It's not too big, not too small. It's a cute little accent. Um, I love it. So I wanted to go to Five and Below because I need to get me another phone holder for my car. But now I'm starting to think I probably should have went there first instead of coming here first because now I got to go to the store with like a nosebleed. Um, and she said that if you ever got your nose pierced, let me know how you took care of yours. They gave me like a take care sheet. She told me that I need to get sea salt. I think I have sea salt at home. Sea salt and warm water to take care of it for like two to three weeks. Um, the little cotton ball that she gave me, she said that I can use, that was alcohol on it. Um, for like the next two days, I can clean it with alcohol. But after that, clean it with the sea salt and warm water. But yeah, like that's probably, this is probably one of the best impulse decisions I've ever made because I've been wanting this for my whole life and I've just been too scared. Um, will I say, I don't know, did the numbing cream help? Probably slightly, but just the same as the wax. Like I still felt it. It still was like a little, it was like a, but let me stop moving my nose so much. Um, the bleeding has calmed down. You can still see there's a little bit of blood around there, but I don't want to move it too much because... She told me don't move it. I think that moving it will make it bleed more and then I don't want it to cause an infection, so. Okay guys, 
full rack of the brush cleaner. I think I'm gonna get me this little wash machine thing. I've seen that on TikTok. I think I'm gonna get that. Look at this makeup section, y'all. I mean, of course it's not Ulta, but I ain't never seen a bottom below like this. Like, y'all, if my nose wasn't running like this, it's giving me a run for my money. I gotta go in the house, but I gotta pick up a few things. Let me show y'all what I get when I get in the house. All right, y'all, so I just got back in the house. I definitely cleaned it up a lot. Like, there was a lot of scabs. Don't look at my eyelashes. Y'all know something right there. Um, but I definitely, I was trying to be careful, but then it was like, I could only be but so careful because I needed to clean around like where it has not scabbed up, but like where the dried up blood was. But now it looks so much better because before you could not even see the, the stud. Like, dang, I know the stud was small, but it was covered in blood. So blood warning again, if you don't like blood, I cleaned it up with some Q-tips. I know that I, it's not like recommended for Q-tips. I feel like this first time I probably should have used the Q-tip to get like around it. And she told me don't move it. I try not to move it too much, but I also had to get up in the inside. I'm going to be very careful with it from, I don't know what's on my hair, from today on out. But yeah, I think it's cute. Don't mind my shirt. I waste, um, what was I eating? That sauce I was eating earlier, I wasted on my shirt. Actually here and here. So anyways, yeah, I'm back in the house. My nose was a little bit better. It had started bleeding again really bad in the car because I had to sneeze and then it like squeezed my nose. But period, your girl is part of the nose ring gang now. Um, but I'm just about to chill. I'm probably going to edit. The, I don't know why I put my shades back on in the house, but you know how girl, hang it, hang girl. Um, but no, I'm probably just going to edit this video because I'm going to finish this up now. Oh, let me show y'all what I got from bottom below real quick because I definitely went overboard. Um, and then I'm going to bake me some cinnamon buns because I really want some snack. But I did not feel like, I didn't feel like stopping by the cookie store, so I didn't. And I also had a cookie yesterday. I'm going to sit on the floor um, and show y'all like a child what I got this month. So, oh my god, and I got something else that I should have tried, but we'll put this out later. Um, yeah, it's kind of dark. I don't feel like getting my ring lights, so deal with it. Um, but, this, oh no, I didn't get this. This came from somewhere else. Um, I got two of these little tables. They had these, and I think they were like $10. I was like, okay, go ahead, go ahead with the bargain. Um, because I don't have a vanity, and eventually, of course, I want to get a vanity, but I'm kind of trying to wait until. I move so I can have like I don't see there's no excuse so I can get a vanity now but right now I just use my little drawer that I have my stuff in um my makeup my hair stuff in to like hold my makeup and it's a mess this is not that big but I was like I can sit this little table beside it and you know just put stuff when I'm doing my makeup put it on here instead of like trying to pile it onto that little shelf thing so I got two of these I think I'm gonna put one by my bed as a nightstand because I don't have a nightstand just because I'm lazy. So I was like, let me, oh no, this is only $5. They say $5, girl, we. Okay, it works. Uh, I feel like I'm missing a bag, though. I don't know. I got a car vacuum. I showed y'all, did I show y'all the car vacuum? No, I got a little car vacuum. I had to take it back because it was used. When I opened it, it was dirt already in there. And I was like, oh, no, 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 no. So she traded me out. But it's actually a really strong suction. I left it in the car. But I told y'all I was gonna get this makeup brush washing machine because I've seen this on TikTok a few times like a while, while back. In the well, well, west. No, I'm kidding. But no, I've seen this a while ago. I actually think this is what was missing batteries. I got batteries, but I don't think I got enough. Cause I got a little, I was, I, my, I ordered a wireless, a pink wireless mouse to go with my MacBook and I have no idea where it is. I have to call Amazon. So I, I found me, I found a wireless mouse somewhere. See, I think that's, oh no, it's on this side. I think the batteries in here. Yeah, this little cheap thing, but I'm gonna use this, see what it's like when I'm um, editing this video tonight. Because I don't know, I just don't like the keypad, the touchpad on the MacBook, so whatever. I don't know, I gotta talk to Amazon, figure out where my pink one is. Um, and then I just got me a little screen protector real quick, because the one I got on my phone is trash. Some batteries for the mouse and I got this thing, a green screen backdrop. I didn't need it like a backdrop. So I was like, okay, let me see. It includes mounting strips. I didn't even know that. Okay, I did not know that. So I'm gonna set this up in the second room. And y'all probably, if y'all see me sit down, I'm gonna sit down in my next video just so y'all can see what this background looks like. Cause I'm like, you know, it's bargaining. Okay, I was like, okay, something like that. Something below had so much stuff. I'm definitely going back there. 
And then the last thing I got, I actually was gonna order this off of like this website for like a hundred dollars. We probably know that just came from Bottom Low. It's not gonna be the best. But I was like, let me try it out before I buy the real one. This is a 360 view Bluetooth camera holder. So it mounts, rotates, it rotates to follow you as you record your videos. So I was like, okay, cute. And then that's why I got batteries for this too. I actually might have enough batteries. So that was it. That's all I got. And I'm very excited. Let me show y'all this up close. This is what it looks like. This is what the back looks like. You see how little cute. Okay, okay. It says this has face tracking, object tracking, 360 moving around head, a tripod. Oh, it's compatible with going to your tripod. I don't have a tripod. I need to get one. Um, app integrated and it's Android and iOS compatible. Great use for YouTube, TikTok, and Facebook. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll see what's going on with this. I'm going to tell y'all when I'm using this to record a video, but yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It, it became more eventful as the day went on. I didn't know I was going to do all these things. So, you're welcome. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, you're probably actually going to see me in the same outfit because I just realized I forgot to film an intro. So you're gonna see me in this outfit and then I'll come back at the end and then I can get the thing. Okay, anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. What was your favorite part? My lips are super dry. Um, and make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at Kaylina so far on the score. It's gonna be on the bottom of the screen here. And then, Turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when I post, okay? Okay. Your girl is filling herself with her new piercing. Now, uh, please pray to God that it don't get infected and I get a keyboard. I'm pretty, I'm normally pretty good with my piercing, so. Two months to go before I can take it out. So, I'll keep y'all updated and we'll see what the journey is like, okay? Okay, y'all gonna see me show it on, okay? <laughs> anyway, see you guys later. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you next week. Bye.